Thanksgiving is just around the corner, and the organizers of the community Thanksgiving dinner, a free program open to everyone in the community in need of a place to be on Thanksgiving, are now asking for your help this morning. KSNT News reporter James Ryan is live in central Topeka to explain why organizers are still asking for donations this morning. Brittany, there's only nine days until Thanksgiving, and currently the Community Thanksgiving Dinner Foundation does not have what they need to put together a meal. The foundation serves more than 2,500 people a free Thanksgiving dinner each year, providing a place for people that are in need or also people who are just alone during the holidays. This year, they are in need of cash and food donations that make the meal possible. It's kind of becoming a nail biter this year. But uh, I have faith in the community. They'll come together, and they always do. There hasn't been a year where we don't have enough. It's just, you know, we're going to have enough Wednesday night, the night before dinner, or, you know, we're going to be able to breathe a little easy on Monday. Organizers are still in need of things like canned green beans, canned yams, instant mashed potatoes, stuffing, and cranberries, all things that really make a Thanksgiving meal complete. And on the flip side, the foundation has only raised a quarter of their $12,000 cash donation goal, and that's where the really heavy lifting comes in. Those cash donations pay for the turkeys, the pies, and the ability to rent ag hall to be able to have that space so that they can bring people together. So the foundation is really hoping that the community will come together to make sure that this dinner happens as planned. Live in Central Topeka, James Ryan, KSNT News. All right, thank you, James, for the details. Now, if you do want to help out, you can bring your cash donations to Core First Bank and Trust in Topeka, and you can also drop off any food donations at any Topeka Fire Department.